Feminists around the world have reacted with horror to a new line of GPS-equipped underwear that has come out for women. It's called Pussy on a Leash. Just kidding. The quote-unquote find-me-if-you-can range of underwear has been described as a high-tech, modern-day chastity belt. The lingerie creator says her designs target modern, tech-savvy women. I say your design targets video game enthusiasts and board game lovers. The beaver hunter. Or hide and seek a peek. Hackers are going to come out of the woodwork on this. Women all over are going to be having convulsions of pleasure if their GPS comes equipped with vibrating alerts. Peach puddles. The lingerie line consists of a lace bow dice. What the hell is a bow dice? Bikini bottom. Yummy. And a pearl collar. Not a necklace. A collar. Be gentle, ladies, but I have to do this. Woof, woof. Think about the possibilities, girl. You're sitting at a bar. Some hot, shoot guy. How you doing? Comes walking over, buys you a drink, and you simply slip him a little piece of paper with the password on it. Talk about pussy control. The creator went on to say it's not a modern day chastity belt. Some men think they can keep tabs on their women, but they're wrong. Well, of course they're wrong. Men can also keep tabs on their boyfriends. You're going to see pimps on the street walking around with laptop computers collecting their booty. Yeah, booty. Get it? Plenty. The GPS lingerie sells from a cool $1,000 for a basic GPS system to $1,400 with a more advanced GPS system. But feminists in her homeland have called her a modern day slaver and urged women to boycott this product. Sounds to me like some women out there Need to set the vibrating alerts. Bzzz. Peach puddles. Hmm. I can see a new comic book here. Wherever there is danger. Wherever there is a man with a bottle of Jurgens and a tube sock. Da da da! Pussy pants to the rescue!